Welcome back, guys. Uh, today I take a look. I thought I'd take a look at uh, a Puppy Linux, another Puppy Linux distribution. This is LX Pup. Basically, it's Puppy Linux with the LXDE uh, desktop environment. It is. Um, if you want to try Puppy, but you're not so sure about the the standard Puppy desktop environment, you might want to try this. It has the LXDE menus, which you should be fairly comfortable with, and um, it it's pretty nice. Now the thing is, this is the 32-bit version. What I installed it the exact same way. The installer is the same as the standard installer, so and you just pick your uh, whether you want to go to a, a boot drive or a, a USB flash drive or a full install and then you check your drive type the drive that you want to install to and then you select the partition you can use gparted from within the file set for the uh, installer so it, it's it's a fairly easy install and it it's basically the same as the uh, the standard puppy installer but this one you end up with the LXDE desktop environment now as you can see on the desktop there is the um, the installer and then the now this is an online so I guess it's uh, I'm going to click on it in a minute but and and also interestingly this popped on my screen once I finished the install and it gives you the option to activate your Broadcom uh, Wi-Fi which is outstanding now I did activate it and I did install the drivers and I did get it working also I have uh, NVIDIA working and let's see what I have the 35263 so that was installed by uh, installing the driver the same way that I showed you in the other video um, so everything is pretty much the same except you end up with the LXDE desktop environment now if I click on that uh, it's support pages for LX pup there's a 32-bit version from what I can gather the 32-bit version is based upon the uh, tar pup or the Ubuntu based version but there are 64 bit versions and those are based on Slackware so either one I mean if you want to try the 64 bit it is available as you can see it's a little bit different look and uh, there are other um, wallpapers there's, there's more wallpapers available uh, LX pup themed wallpapers uh, so if you and I will um, I'll post these uh, links to the websites here is a download page for LX pup tar and that's the 15.12 so you can download directly from SourceForge and also there's the 64 bit so you can and there are uh, various versions as you can see there's the 14 the 15 and the 16 and there's this is a 64 bit so there are a couple of uh, links that I'll give you but other than that everything is it is puppy Linux uh, it's just with a different desktop environment that you might be a little more comfortable with and uh, I I've tested it briefly here and it's working fine now as I mentioned before the only way um, I've gotten the puppy distributions to boot is by using unit bootin and I'm not sure if that's everybody else's experience but I am more likely to get it boot to boot if I use unit bootin and also interestingly it won't boot from a hub from a USB hub but it will boot from the motherboard USB so on the back of your motherboard on the back of your computer you've got some USB uh, ports that's what I'm using to boot the installer and then I do the install so 
uh, just uh, just giving you the information that I've been able able to gather. And so uh, that is it. It's LX Pup. Again, if you've been a little bit put off by the standard puppy interface, um, this one might make you a little bit more comfortable. And as I said, NVIDIA is running. My firewall is running. Uh, all of the same uh, for the, for this for this um, tarpup. All of the packages are usable for the 32-bit and the 64-bit. You need to pull the correct packages. I gave you those links in the last video. So if you install the 64-bit uh, LX pup, then make sure you're installing from the from the 64-bit package repository and same goes for 32-bit. Now the Slacko version I am not sure. I have not installed the Slacko version. I can only speak for the Tarpup or the LX Pup version. So that is it guys. Uh, as you can see GUVC view, simple screen recorder, everything is running fine. Uh, that's it for LX Pup. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for stopping by the channel and I'll see you soon. Take care.